This content is intended for educational purposes only. Unauthorized use of these techniques is illegal. Please act responsibly. Welcome to my channel. In this video, I'm going to show you how cyber criminals can track you and collect information about you simply by getting you to click on a link they sent. I'll walk you through how this is possible, what happens in the background, and most importantly, how you can protect yourself. Quick disclaimer before we start. This content is for educational purposes only. The goal of this demonstration is to raise awareness about online threats. This video is not meant to encourage hacking or illegal activity. Everything shown here is happening in a controlled environment using my own devices. Tools like this are often developed for cybersecurity professionals and licensed investigators to track scammers or criminals online. Now, let's get started. In this terminal, we're going to use a tool called Eyes Tracker. Tools like this are usually developed by OSINT investigators and cybersecurity experts for research and investigation. Let's run the tool and see how it works. As you can see, it's now asking me to enter either my machine IP or a port forwarded IP address. This is important because the target's device needs a way to connect back to the tracker. For this demonstration, I'll use 127.0.0.1 as my machine IP since I'm working on my local network, and I'll enter 8000 as the port number. Now, the tool has generated a tracking link using the IP and port I entered earlier. At this point, all that's left is to send the link to the target and wait for them to open it. Let's go ahead and simulate this by opening the link on my mobile device. As you can see, the terminal has now received a connection from the target device. The system is processing the request, processing network tunnel handshake, verifying encryption keys, establishing secure channel, streaming device telemetry, and so on. Just keep watching so you can understand how this actually work and how the target's data will be extracted from the target device to our own terminal machine. Just keep your eyes on this, so you won't miss out. And finally, here we are, the target device information is displayed on the terminal. Everything is working exactly as expected. You can now see details such as GPS coordinates, country, city, internet service provider, and even the browser being used on the device. Like I said earlier, tools like this work because of APIs, libraries, and background scripts that can reveal things like browser information, operating system, location, and network data. This is how cyber criminals, investigators, or OSINT researchers are able to track someone once they click on a link. Before we wrap up, one last disclaimer. This video is strictly for educational purposes. I did not hack anyone. All devices used in this demonstration belong to me, and everything happened inside a safe, controlled environment. Stay safe, stay protected, and most importantly, stay ethical. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and click the bell icon to stay ahead in cybersecurity. Check out more videos here to keep your knowledge sharp.